With the current pandemic situation that we're facing, working from home is a new norm and having my own established workspace is even more important and urgent. Hi there, I'm Reese. Welcome back to my channel, Minimalist Home Interior Makeover. A space where we can feel productive, focused and inspired. Some of you may have a dedicated study room set up for work desk, but as for me, my work desk happened to be in my bedroom. My goal is very simple, is to have a workspace that is clean and neat within my bedroom. Today I'm going to share with you three main tips to consider before setting up a work desk in your bedroom. Tip number one is that you want to measure your space. Okay, so what I did before I got in my IKEA work desk is that I measured the length that I want. So it was approximately 150 cm length and I didn't want my desk to be so deep. So it's approximately 40 to 50 cm. That's what I'm looking for. So yes, you want to measure your desk before you get the furniture into your space. Also, you want to bring along your measuring tape to measure the furniture that you want to purchase on the spot. Tip number two is to prepare a checklist of the items that you want to purchase. At the same time, check the prices online so that you can work within your budget. Three is that you can do research online to get some DIY ideas. So like for, for me, for instance, I didn't want to spend so much money on redecorating. So I used back some of my old items and uh, remake it and uh, remodel it to something more interesting. So you can do the same thing too. Finally guys, I've got my work desk set up over the weekend. Okay, I try to keep it uh, minimalist as possible and I didn't want to spend so much for it. But yet, I needed a working desk uh, so badly. So I got this desk. Um, the length wise is just nice because it's 150 cm um, length. Which, is, uh, which fits this, this corner of my room perfectly and has two drawers for me to put some of my books inside or keys, wallet or whatsoever okay this series is called Mickey from IKEA and I've gotten two book folders as well this is where I, I could put in my favorite books and that's my picture and also a metal frame which you can get it less than 10 ringgit I believe I got it ages ago and these are all the prints that I could um, you know, print out from uh, certain websites and uh, I got it printed colours as well because I love coats, I love pictures of plants yeah and you can actually DIY it for free yeah it can be the centerpiece and um, this is actually a stationery folder which I got it a long time ago too yeah so I can get whatever stationeries that I want uh, while working fake plant that I had before and also I've just gotten this lamp lamp shade from IKEA too this cost me about um, 100 ringgit yeah and uh, the Mickey work desk cost me about less than 400 ringgit and together with my working chair yay yeah, and this cost me about 189 ringgit. So in all, I spent less than 800 ringgit to get my work desk set up. So tell me guys, do give me a comment. How do you find my work desk? Okay, so this can be easily set up by anyone or probably you can do a better one. And um, yeah, do feedback me with your comments and I would love to hear what do we have. Okay guys, finally enjoy shopping and enjoy the whole process of setting up a workspace for yourself so that all of us are, can be more motivated and inspired to complete the projects that we have on hand. If you like my channel, give me a like and subscribe to the button below. Okay, feel free to comment and give me some ideas so that I can prepare more videos for you. Thank you. Goodbye.